Open your mind. 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 Ugh. Just straight away. Ugh. Project Scam a lot. It's their bi monthly scamathon. Hi everyone, it's Kerry's Update, aka the latest beg for money. This is what people who go to the job centre, who sign up for benefits, this is when they have to go down and actually have to talk to the person. You know, and pretend that they've been looking for work. She wakes up on these days like, oh, I've got to do it. I've got to do that video and pretend that, you know, I'm actually working for my money. This is sad at this point. I'm Carrie Cassidy from Project Camelot. Just wanted to say Happy New Year and let you know that I just completed two interviews here in Great Britain in the London area. One with Simon Parks. Ugh. Fraud. Fraud with Simon Parks. I'm a I was Illuminati. I'm an insectoid mother. And the Russian and Putin's in contact with the, oh, the dude is the dude has weaved this insane alien narrative to cover up what I suspect was some horrible, vicious, perhaps satanic, um, ritualistic abuse he may have, may have suffered as a child or something. Uh, you know, just the way that you relays these memories, and it's just so weird. It's just, it's another one of those things where nobody's interacting the way that real people interact towards each other when uh, when he relays these stories. So, but this wasn't supposed to be about Simon. I've got a show about Simon, like an hour long or something, where, um, and I nailed it as well. I'll tell you, I nailed it. In that, by the way, if you go back and watch that, I've got go just go on my channel, find uh, the Simon Parks thing, uh, and I accurately point out that that bitch tried to take his soul, man. She tried to invade his soul on that video, and later on they confirmed that that woman, Sarah Summer Scales, I think her name was, she did indeed try to in invade Simon's soul or get inside or something like that. Um, you know, because he did that shiver thing. <laughs> And, um, yeah, much more likely that they saw my video and then they were like, oh, that's a good idea. Anyway, let's get back to this. And the other with uh, Michael Shrimpton, who's an English barrister. <laughs> I love this dude. People remember the uh, London Olympics by any chance. He was arrested for <laughs> warning the UK government about a nuke threat during the... <laughs> warning. He was arrested for warning the UK government about a nuke threat during the, the 2012 Olympics. As it turned out, he was correct. As it turned out, he was correct. Oh, I missed that news story. As he turned out, as it turned out, he was correct. And look at that little reptilian eye there, by the way. And he is now suing the government for damages. Is he? And the taxpayer, you mean? His case, and I am interviewing him about all of that. He has a, a great background in intelligence, and his has written a book called Spy Hunter. I'm None also of you have any background in intelligence. And we will do a sit-down one-on-one interview. That's been a yep, long huh. time coming. He spoke a number of times this summer at Ooh. my conferences. A minute in, how long do you think it'll take her to get to the Begum Thon? So we need money for our outdated methods of distribution. So we're going to be catching up with uh, Peter Padgett, and then when Peter I get Pan. back to the U.S. after January 9th, on January 18th, I'll be interviewing William Tompkins again 
for the second time, and this will be a live Ooh. interview uh, done on my YouTube channel, and he will be on the phone or Skype, depending on what we can manage to do. So, um, a lot going on with Camelot, and the past year has been uh, extremely busy for Camelot, and we've released a number of interviews. So, um, really, there are like 569 interviews on my YouTube channel. So, highly recommend all of them. And uh, no, not all of them. Maybe like five percent of I them. I need a new camera uh, to assist with in-person interviews, like I'm doing yeah. lately. And um, Buy one, then. so could use a new iMac for oh, editing. Uh, my webmaster Igor, could use a new computer, oh. and we need uh, money to pay the server costs because Camelot is taking up. Get a job. Get a job. We have a new project coming out called Camelot Connections. Camelot Connections will be cut there. I wish I had to break down. With other people. So it's a great time to connect with others. So hopefully this new um, app that we're creating will make all that possible. We could use any donations to help us along our way. Um, oh, donations, so a lot going money, on. Uh, computers, it's cameras. A fascinating year in 2017. So she can sit and there and interview I people. I appreciate all your help during the year and support. And um, thanks again for watching Project Camelot. Take care. Uh, right at the end, look. Donate. We get it. Just. If you donate, you're a vegetable. <laughs>